Hi guys, Evan from Atlantic Outboard in Portland Boatworks here. Uh, today I am on a 2024 Tierra 38 LS and I'm going to walk you through some of the great features that this boat has to offer. First things first is this stock boat has the upgraded motors, has triple V10 400 Mercury outboards on there. Uh, these are the new V10s from Merc. Totally changes the boat from the previous generation 400s. Really nice upgrade. The boat cruises right around 40 miles an hour, gets great fuel economy and it's just a awesome awesome running boat because of those motors uh, as you all probably know about this boat that has the swivel uh, aft facing seat right here uh, we have a lock button right here that unlocks it and this whole thing can spin so if you're cruising whatever at the dock anchored this whole thing spins 180 degrees and locks facing backwards this has a nice teak table on this platform as well what i like about it is this part goes flat and it comes with a cushion set. So this whole thing turns into a really nice sunbed if you choose to use that feature. We have two aft facing seats right here, uh, just uh, aft of the standard, or excuse me, optional grill that this boat's equipped with. We have a drawer right here. Underneath that, we have a slide out uh, refrigerator as well, which is really good size, has a lot of uh, great storage options for you there. Down below, this boat's equipped with a sea keeper and a diesel generator, so if you want to have your AC or heat going with the generator, you can use that at all times. Up above us here, we have our uh, electric sunshade, which as you can see, extends out quite a ways and gives plenty of shade to this whole seat. What I really like about this system is you can lock it in certain spots, so you don't have to have it all the way out if you don't want to, you can have a half out or, or what have you. Moving forward to the helm area, okay, this boat's equipped with a standard 16 inch Garmin Electronics. Uh, all the boats come standard with the Mercury joystick as well. What's nice about that is you get the skyhook option, you get the uh, autopilot, and all that good stuff. Three booming helm seats, each equipped with their own armrest, okay, which is a really nice feature. Uh, this boat's equipped with an optional refrigerator, which is located underneath this seat right here. You can either have an ice maker there or a freezer, depending on what you choose to do. One other really great feature I like about this boat, especially for our vertically challenged friends, is this step right here. This whole thing folds down, okay? And you can see, you get a nice line of sight if you're on the shorter side and want to have some pretty good visibility. Let's take a peek down below in the cabin. Down here in the cabin on the 38 LS, you see we have a ton of room for storage, sleeping, what have you. We have a storage in both of those compartments up above here. Really big storage right here, which is a great spot with a hanging locker. Um, we have a smart TV right here. So while you're laying in bed, you have great access to television. Uh, but what's really nice about this boat is we have a really large uh, head in the boat. As you can see, we have a really beautiful sink, ton of storage, freshwater head system. Um, so it's really good size for, a, you know, pretty good size for a day boat. Uh, but this cabin is really nice. What allows us to have so much room in this boat is off to the port side. We have the uh, steps going off from a, a fixed dock access. And we'll, we'll talk about that more once we get up in the bow. But it just allows so much room in here and it really makes it a nice, uh, nice feeling down here. Up in the bow area on the 38 LS, you'll see we have a ton of room for socializing. The boat's equipped with the optional table that screws right into these posts right here. Um, and that table actually stores right here, so it's nice, easy to get to. You can see we have ample seating around this whole area. When I mentioned before of having that uh, extension of the cabin right there, you can see because of that, we gain all this seating right here because we don't have to walk around the console like a, tr a traditional center console. The boat has your stereo controls up here, uh, USB plug it up here for your phone, tons of cup holders, tons of armrests, a really comfortable uh, spot to be on the boat. It's equipped with the forward sunshade, which is a nice feature. Uh, it also has the spotlight option, which you can see right on the hard top right there. But one thing I want to make note, look at the windshield, one piece curved glass. Your line of sight and your visibility is out of this world on this boat right here because of sophisticated engineering and design from TR Yachts. Thanks for watching this 38 LS tier walkthrough. I'm Evan from Atlantic Outboard and Portland Boatworks. Don't forget to check us out online at AtlanticOutboard.com and PortlandBoatworks.com. But most of all, don't forget to hit that subscribe button today. See you on the sound.